Global temperatures are due to overshoot the climate targets that scientists and policymakers have set to safeguard people and the planet. As the Earth continues to heat up, emissions from oil and gas are not being reduced in line with climate goals. To achieve climate stability, the energy sector must transition to non-emitting sources, like renewable energy. We can't switch overnight, though. The oil and gas industry is complex, touching all sectors of the economy. Assets trade globally, and finished products fan out to all sectors, both for energy and material inputs. In this decisive decade, as we work to lessen global dependence on oil and gas, we also need solutions that immediately reduce greenhouse gas emissions from the oil and gas sector. Not all oils and gases are created equal, as you can see here. Some are solid like peanut butter, others are light like nail polish remover, and still others are more conventional. Some of these emit far more methane and carbon dioxide than others, and the climate risks are greater for some oils and gases than others. Oil and gas climate footprints vary by at least a factor of 10, depending on different resource characteristics and the ways that they are produced. This presents an enormous opportunity to harness data and enhance transparency to choose smart oil and gas reduction plans. The Climate Intelligence Program at RMI created the Oil Climate Index Plus gas web tool, known as OCI Plus, to quantify the differences in oil and gas climate footprints. The OCI Plus is a unique open source web tool that provides independent analysis with advanced models and satellite data to estimate greenhouse gas emissions through the oil and gas supply chain from extraction through end-use consumption. The OCI Plus project assesses the climate impacts from the majority of global oil and gas production using data from hundreds of oil and gas fields around the world. When it comes to climate risks, there is no standard oil or gas due to their wide-ranging climate footprints. While emissions differences between oil and gas assets are big enough to matter, accounting for these differences is currently inadequate. For example, the U.S. government's emissions factors for oil and gas significantly undercount the total emissions from this critical sector. The blue bars in the chart represent the resources currently modeled in the OCI Plus project. Most of them are above regulators' prescribed emissions factors, which are represented by the dashed lines on the chart. This means that decision makers are systematically undercounting emissions from oil and gas supply chains. The OCI Plus improves oil and gas emissions transparency, accounting, and comparability by providing field-level emission intensity estimates Climate actions can target the dirtiest resources first. The OCI Plus also takes a hard look at methane, the main component in natural gas and light oils. Methane is a potent pollutant that calls for increased focus, especially in the oil and gas sector. Methane persists in the atmosphere for a decade, heating the planet and polluting the air. Compared to the equivalent amount of carbon dioxide, Methane warms the planet over 80 times more powerfully over a 20-year time frame. Decisive action is needed by responsible parties, and the OCI Plus helps decision makers get there. For example, if a carbon tax or methane fee is imposed on the oil and gas industry, the OCI Plus specifies where in the supply chain emissions occur and who is responsible. The web tool breaks down emissions from each actor, producers, refiners, shippers, and end-use consumers. This means that each polluter pays for their fair share of the climate pollution they cause. The climate intelligence generated by the OCI Plus helps policymakers, operators, the financial community, and civil society achieve emission reductions with better maintenance, regulations, and lending practices. For more information, please visit our website. RMI is using the OCI Plus and its publicly available data to make emissions visible, create platforms that properly account for emissions, set standards, verify pledges to reduce emissions, certify the industry's emissions, and activate climate markets. With better climate intelligence, 
we can make better decisions to prevent global temperatures from dangerously rising. To learn more about RMI's ongoing work, please visit our website at rmi.org.